Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, don't forget to hit subscribe for new videos every single week. I'm a big wet shaver. I love wet shaving. I love the feeling of it. But one of the things that comes with post shaving is that post shave irritation. Now a decent shaving routine with a good blade and a good shaving cream goes a long way to protecting you from razor burn. But a good post shave balm is always appreciated. It's a nice way to just finish off the shave. It should have ingredients in there that helps repair and protect your skin reduce any irritation or any redness you might get and just set you up ready to finish off with your moisturizer and sunscreen etc. So what I want to do today guys is I want to look at three post shave balms which are fairly easy to get whether it be in the drugstore or whether it be online. I'm going to be looking at the Jack Black post shave cooling gel, the L'Oreal Men Expert with Hydro Power anti-discomfort refreshing post shave splash it's a ridiculous name Pro Razo um, cream liquid or cream liquida I don't know what it means basically it's an anti-irritation cream now they do several different versions of this this is the sensitive skin one so this is the one I use alongside their sensitive shave and their sensitive um, pre-shave cream so to start with, we'll look at the Jack Black Post Shave Cooling Gel with aloe, sage and lavender. So aloe, aloe vera, obviously is very, very good for the skin. Sage and lavender are particularly good for healing. Um, they also take away sensitivity. Doesn't feel very nice to use, I'll be absolutely honest with you. Putting it on and finishing, it's actually quite tacky. In fact, it's very tacky, unpleasantly so. Not particularly keen on this one, I have to say is the L'Oreal Men Expert with Hydro Power. Quite a bit runnier than the Jack Black. It smooths across the skin very, very easily. I bought this, I think it was Tesco's, and it was £2.80 compared to the Jack Black, which is £17. And I have to say, the feel of this L'Oreal is better than the Jack Black, and it hasn't got that horrible tackiness when you've finished. Moving to the Pro Razo. Now, this has green tea and oatmeal. Green tea, great antiseptic, so very good for um, helping to prevent bacterial ingress when you've got such raw open skin. The oatmeal is quite good for helping to rebuild your skin barrier. Very runny. The nicest smelling of the three, I think. A little bit of a cooling effect as well, which is nice. No stinging at all, which is particularly something I'd expect from this being that it's in their sensitive skin range. Goes into the skin very, very easily. So there we have three products at quite different price points. The Proazo coming in at around £12 on Amazon. I'll provide a link down below. The L'Oreal, ridiculously cheap at £2.80. And the Jack Black, pushing the boat out a little bit at £17. So, three very different products different prices, what do I think? First off, the Jack Black, not particularly nice to use, a little bit over thick for my liking, hated the tackiness of it. If I had done a blind test of this, if these had been in unlabeled bottles, my assumption would have been that this was the cheapest, not the most expensive, because it had a horrible feeling once you used it. This for me is a definite no-go, so in the bin with that one. The L'Oreal, Works well, nice cooling effect, um, just ridiculously cheap, but this is definitely a winner. For £2.80, you cannot go wrong. Definitely, definitely worth getting if you want to post shave balm and you're on a budget. The Pro Razo, now I do love all the Pro Razo products that I've tried before. I love their creams, I love their, their pre shave um, cream that they do. This, again, is another quality product glass bottle which is excellent because it's recyclable most people think oh well plastic you know you can recycle it generally speaking most plastics can only be recycled two or three times at the most glass is infinitely re uh, is infinitely recyclable 12 pounds so a lot more expensive you're talking about nine pound more expensive than the l'oreal is it nine pounds better than l'oreal probably if you can afford to pay a little bit more at the three I'd recommend the Carrazzo, but if you're on a budget, the L'Oreal will do you just fine, and I certainly would not spend 27 quid on the Jet Black. 
So guys, I hope that video was useful for you. Who knew that a £2.80 post-shave balm could be that good? Please leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Comment below because I read every comment and I'm always appreciative of the feedback. I've been Bear Clark, you've been awesome, and I'll see you again next time.